Hello and welcome to this series of lessons focusing on creating 3D maps using isometric projection presented by Digital Tutors, an Adobe authorized training partner. My name is Eddie and I'll be taking you through the process of designing a street map and then building three-dimensional objects for the map using isometric projection. We'll begin by learning what isometric projection is and how it differs from traditional linear perspective. From there we'll learn two different methods for creating isometric objects, one using a grid and a second using the scale, shear, and rotate tools inside Illustrator. Along the way we'll learn how to save time by incorporating actions into our workflow. Next we'll jump in and begin designing a top-down, two-dimensional view of our map. From there we'll learn what an orthographic drawing is and how it can help us to construct buildings on top of our map. We'll wrap things up by adding some final details to our map that will really make it shine. After completing these lessons, you'll have a better understanding of how to build a three-dimensional map using isometric projection. So let's go ahead and get started with our next lesson.